Oh, shit, I'm recording. Didn't realize because I'm just soaking up, lounging in my new chair that is just super sick because I'm constantly trying to upgrade the channel because you never know what to expect on the Metal Burb channel, man. I'm constantly improving. Every day is a little bit different. It's crazy, bro. You know what's even more crazy? North Lane dropped their new song. Holy shit. Title Clockwork. And man, you guys know I'm going to be jumping on this ASAP because... Big fam Northlane, been following these guys since Discoveries and uh, Singularity. Like, I love the days with Adrian. I love the days with Marcus, too. Absolutely loved the album Alien, man. I was a big fan of that album. So with this, I don't know if it's going to be more kind of like Alien or if it's a whole different direction. Uh, whatever the case, I'm excited and I think it's going to be good. I know it's going to be good. I know it's going to be good. Even if they go in a whole different direction, I can only expect it to be really good because every member in this band is just, it's so good, man. So good. Am I gushy enough? Yeah, Metal Burb, shut up. Let's get to the reaction. Anyway, that's too much shit chat, so let's fuck do it. Oh, yeah. Also, this chair has a massager. Like, I can massage my back while reacting to music. <laughs> Game changer, bro. Anyway, three, two, one, go. You guys are probably so sick of the chair. I don't care because I love it. Volume up? I'm running Ooh. out of time. Oh, shit. I'm full blown with the electronic elements. Okay. Ooh. Starting kind of reminds me of 4D a little bit. <laughs> oh, they're fully embracing the electronics. Let's go, man. Oh, that is absolute filth. <laughs> I'm chorus. This music video reminds me of Dustin Penzer from Thrice. He has a similar music video where he's on a treadmill. Anyway. This is wild, man. I'm totally digging this. Oh! It's about to drop. Let's go. Come on. Woohoo! Not really a drop, but I, I'm feeling it, man. Woohoo! Okay, there's a drop. I think there's a polyrhythm with that rhythm. It was interesting, man. Marcus, bro, you're about to get run over. Holy shit! 
That sounds so fucking unique. Oh yeah, I got head support too. Massage in my back. Life is good, man. Wow, I have a lot to say about this tune. Okay, I'm gonna pause it. It sound okay, so it sounds like they're fully embracing the electronic elements, which I think is awesome. This is such a cool hybrid of electronic music and metal. Like I feel like Northlane is one of the few bands that can really do it. And I think if they just went fully in this direction, I think fans would be having a hard time, like, you know, adjusting to it. But with Alien, there was kind of that transition. It, it took a long time for some fans to even enjoy it because, like, it was a change of sound for the band, an evolution to their sound. But this sounds like a natural progression from Alien, and it's a big step forward for the genre and, like, something very very fresh this is so fresh it is such a cool hybrid it's almost like electronic I, I wouldn't say dubstep because it, it doesn't go as heavy but it still has that kind of vibe it's almost like a little bit drum and bass a little bit too like the electronic elements were so vibrant and brought so much life to the music and it but it still remains what is Northlane it's still got the genty guitars those beautiful melodies from Marcus and those harsh vocals with like a lot of passion and emotion so it still sounds like post hardcore and metalcore and a little bit progressive too because the structure to this song was so cool. I absolutely love the structure to this song because I don't even remember how it went. Like this is a song that requires more than one listen so on first impression holy shit absolutely loved it. I know on required like or more listens I'm going to appreciate it even more. This was a really cool tune. I actually want to listen to it again so I can pick it apart a little bit better. Okay, I want to mention the drumming in this song is a big standout. Whether or not it's full polyrhythms, I'm trying to figure out the count, but it's still a little bit confusing. So when the first part where the harsh vocals come in, you can just tell the drum beats throwing you off. There has like the one bass kick to the snare hit, and then like the two bass kicks to the snare hit, and then the one bass... Like it just keeps like throwing you off. It never like repeats itself too much. Okay, and another big stand was the breakdown too, and just the rhythm of the breakdown was interesting timing too. I, I couldn't figure out the count and the groove either. If you guys could let me know, that'd be great. But I even in a song that is still melodic and beautiful and heavy and all that, there's still complexity to the music, which I really appreciate. And actually, with electronic music, that's actually something about electronic music that I don't really gravitate towards because it's very four by four. The music, it's very simple to follow, which like it's fun to dance to and stuff. That's kind of the point of a lot of the electronic music. But that's why I love metal because it has a lot of complex complexity to it and I think this is such a cool hybrid of both because because it has those electronic elements and a lot of that like complexity to the music like this song is a great song for casual listeners and also musicians so I think this is a standout track from Northlane I am very impressed man okay another thing I want to talk about is that ending breakdown or ending groove to the song there's a lot of things going on to it which I really enjoyed so guitar work he's hitting those big open notes whether it could be opener and like a note on the low string I'm not sure but he hits those notes and then he hits a whole bunch of harmonics and the drumming is kind of following pattern it could be another polyrhythm I'm trying to figure it out but whether the case like instrumentally it's genty and heavy there but then the synth work there's like two layering it's got that weird bassy synth that's kind of ca carried itself through the song a lot that Then faintly you can hear some notes on like a keyboard that sounds kind of like an arpeggio a little bit. It's very faint to hear so there's that as well. And then on top of it you got Marcus's vocals that are just like mixed so well with like a lot of reverb and it adds like a lot of like uh, background feedback to his voice which I think really worked for this song. Like. I think this song was cool in its initiative and standing out a lot different than other songs in the in the scene. It's a very different song for the scene. It's an evolution for the genre and mixing and mastering I think is really good. Like very, very good. This is a top tier song 
and Northlane did not disappoint. Northlane surpassed my expectations with this one. This, yep. So sick, man. Anyway, that's my thoughts on Northlane Clockwork. I'm curious to know what your thoughts are, so comment down below. Spice up my life. What did you guys think of this tune? I'm curious to know what you guys thought about Northlane going into this newish kind of direction for them. It kind of new. I say that loosely. Also, if you got to this point in the video, then I appreciate the shit out of you, man. But on that, thank you for tuning in. Till next time. Peace.